Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are diving deep into the fascinating world of organized crime to explore the life and criminal career of one of the most notorious mafia figures in American history, John Sonny Francesa Sr. Known for his ruthless tactics and extensive criminal empire, Francesi's story is a captivating tale of power, crime and the pursuit of the American dream, mafia style. So buckle up and let's get started. Born in Naples, Italy on February 6, 1917, Francesi immigrated to the United States with his family at a young age, settling in Brooklyn, New York. Growing up in a tough neighborhood, he was exposed to crime and the Mafia lifestyle from an early age. His father was a known associate of the Mafia, and it was natural for Francesi to follow in his footsteps. As a young man, Francesi quickly became involved in various criminal activities, including robbery and extortion, marking the beginning of his life of crime. His ruthless demeanor and shrewd mind helped him rise through the ranks of the Colombo family, and he soon became one of the family's most trusted and influential members. Francesi's early encounters with the law were marked by a series of arrests and convictions. In 1966, he was convicted of bank robbery and sentenced to 50 years in prison. However, he managed to have his sentence reduced and was released on parole in 1978. This stint in prison did little to deter Francesi from a life of crime, and he quickly returned to his criminal activities upon his release. In addition to his involvement in traditional mafia activities such as loan shocking, racketeering and extortion, Francesi was also known for his involvement in legitimate businesses, using them as fronts for his illegal operations. His charismatic personality and business acumen helped him build a vast criminal empire, solidifying his status as one of the most powerful and feared figures in the world of organized crime. John Sonny Francesi's criminal career was deeply intertwined with the Colombo crime family, one of the infamous five families that dominated organized crime in New York City. The Colombo family played a pivotal role in shaping Francesi's life of crime, providing him with the connections, resources and support he needed to rise through the ranks and become a significant figure in the Mafia world. Francesi's involvement with the Colombo family began in the 1930s, when he became an associate of the organization. His criminal activities, including loan shocking, racketeering and extortion, contributed to the family's vast criminal empire. Francesi's role in the Colombo family's dealings with other crime families was crucial in maintaining a delicate balance of power among the five families. He was known for his ability to navigate the complex web of relationships and alliances that defined the world of organized crime, ensuring that the Colombo family maintained a strong position in the criminal underworld. One notable event that showcased Francesi's influence within the Mafia world was the peace he brokered between the Colombo and the Gambino families in the 1970s. At the time, tensions were high between the two organizations, and Francesi played a key role in mediating the conflict and preventing an all-out war. In summary, the Colombo family was instrumental in Francesi's rise to power and his success in the world of organized crime. His interactions and relationships with other crime families further solidified his position as a significant figure in the Mafia as he played a crucial role in maintaining the balance of power among the various criminal organizations. John Sonny Francesi Sr. had a criminal record that spanned decades with multiple arrests and convictions for a range of crimes. His first significant arrest came in 1966, when he was convicted of bank robbery and sentenced to 50 years in prison. However, he managed to have his sentence reduced and was released on parole in 1978. In 2010, at the age of 93, Francesi was convicted of racketeering and extortion and sentenced to eight years in prison. He was released in 2017 at the age of 100, making him one of the oldest federal inmates in the United States. The legal troubles that Francesi faced over the years had a profound impact on his life and criminal career. Each arrest and conviction served as a temporary setback forcing him to step back from his criminal activities. However, Francesi always managed to bounce back, returning to his life of crime with even greater determination and cunning. 
Francesi's place in the history of organized crime is cemented by his long and prolific criminal career, as well as his association with the Colombo crime family. His legacy is one of both fear and admiration, as he was known for his ruthless tactics and sharp business acumen. John Sonny Francesi Sr. was a significant figure in the world of organized crime, with a criminal career that spanned decades. His arrests and convictions were mere bumps on the road, as he always managed to return to his life of crime. His influence and legacy within the Mafia world are undeniable, and he will be remembered as one of the most powerful and feared figures in the history of organized crime. And there you have it, the incredible story of John Sony Francesi Sr., a man whose life was intricately woven into the fabric of organized crime in America. From his humble beginnings to becoming a pivotal figure in the Colombo crime family, Francesi's journey is a testament to the complex and often brutal world of the Mafia. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.